Hi right, guys, so we're here at Subaru Pembroke Pines and we got this, this is what, the Solar uh, Orange? Solar Orange. All right, Solar Orange 2022 WRX. And since I got out of my SDI, I wanna see if the new WRX compares to it driving wise. guys so we're continuing from the last episode and we're going to jump straight into our review of the 2022 subaru wrx now obviously we're a little bit disappointed that there's no more uh sti so we're gonna test drive the the new 22 uh, subaru wrx and see what it feels like compared to the 21 sti that we used to own and obviously we we're heading out there in the tacoma so Hop in, come along for the ride, and I hope you guys enjoy this one. All right, guys, so we're here at Subaru Pembroke Pines, and we got this, this is what, the Solar uh, Orange? Solar Orange. All right, Solar Orange 2022 WRX, and this is going, this is like a courtesy vehicle for the auto show that they're gonna have in South Florida, but what do you guys think, man? I think Q is getting one like this. So, so we're, we're previewing Q to Chaotic's car here, but this thing, looks amazing in person man like i don't know if the camera's doing it any justice but it is beautiful and, and they got it and and another thing a cool thing about subaru pembroke pines they sell their cars at msrp so if you guys want this bad boy you can scope this up for 39k that is yeah man that's it i'm glad you guys do business the way that you do because there's not too many dealerships that are doing things the right way like you, you know? To help you. Yeah, man. So yeah, Louis, this is a guy that I bought my SDI from, guys. So all right. yeah, he's a good guy. <laughs> yeah, so, all right. Um, and you say you have one that I can go test drive and check it out real quick? Uh, let me see if it's still available. All right. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna see if we can go find like a, another SDI because this one is going to the auto show. So we can't take this particular one out. But I want to go get like a full experience of what it's like driving the new 22 WRX. So let's see if they got one that we could go check out. All right, guys. So this is the 22 Subaru WRX. And since I got out of my SDI, I want to see if the new WRX compares to it driving wise. And I kind of know it is already, but I just need to experience it myself and experience the drive and see what it feels like compared to the SDI. So. Without further ado, let's go check this one out. So this is a 22, do you know what trim level this is? Limited. Okay, so this is the limited. So we got the manual gearbox, we got the sunroof. And I, I don't, huh? Yeah, let's see. Oh man, I missed this key. This key fob, yeah. Yeah. Be I love the seats on these. And this one comes with the Harman Kardon uh, speakers. So you know it's gonna sound good. The seats real nice and plush. Dana, come check this out, man. Check out these seats. We got, we got, we got to let him, you know. It's a, it's a hell of a vehicle. Yeah, sit in, sit in there and tell me what that feel you like to you. You want to see your, your back? Yeah. It looks nice, right? Yeah, for a Subaru. <laughs> oh God. Yeah, hey, uh, guys, don't don't beat him up in the comments. He's a. Uh, he, he has his own brands that he sticks to and that's it and subaru is not one of them so <laughs> but look at the look at the size of that screen you see the screen yeah, yeah. oh yeah 11.6 wow yeah seats are nice though yeah yeah seats are nice and the guy, right. it actually has a good sound system. got a good i'm telling you man like yo even the and we see the rear speed the rear seat space oh yeah oh yeah yeah you got a whole lot of seat space back here you want to take a look at the deal, the price? Yeah, let me see. What's the price on this one? This one is forty thousand even. Okay, it's not bad for a limited. That's not bad. This is a two point oh. Yeah, no, two point four, two point four. Yeah, turbo. Yeah. All right. Yeah. So we're gonna take this this for a little spin. Uh, can he come with me? Yeah. All right, so yeah, you just hold this. Huh? All right, all right. All right. <laughs> oh, wow, that 
actually sounds better than the SDI when it first started. Like stock to stock. Hmm. Yeah. I wouldn't know. It does. It does. Let me see if I remember how this. Okay, so it's there. It's like, it feels like I've been out of the SDI so long, but. <laughs> should be able to manage. Yeah, yeah, I should be. I mean, yeah. if you cut off, do you want me to edit that out? <laughs> nah, nah, nah. <laughs> We're keeping it all in. Let me see. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. I remember now. <laughs> yeah, it took, me, it took me a while. I was thinking it was like the truck. All right. Dude, I love the way the exhaust sounds. Must have gotten it from like a German manufacturer. Oh God! Oh, why are you hating on Subi, man? That Subi. means I would drive a Civic before I drive a Subi, though. Wow! Why? Get all this. Nobody want to see me. <laughs> Did we go through that last time? All right. I mean, there's nothing much here to see. It's like yeah. Well, they they won't want to see the driving dynamics, dude. This feels good. Oh, I'm not gonna lie. I would say just coming off the parking lot. This feels better than SDI. I mean, we could, we could, we could get it today if you want. Yeah, uh, I know you can, not me. <laughs> All right, let's see. Okay, feels about okay. So the SCI, whoop, oh, I forgot over here, but over here is like, but the SCI has a little bit more torque and boom, but smoothness. Way smoother. How is it shifting? Yeah, it's smooth. Smooth. I actually like this, man. Oh man, this is a perfect daily driver type car. Like if you're just gonna have a daily, like you already have your race car and everything. Huh. This is perfect. Like, see, the SDI driving it used to stress me out. <laughs> really? Yeah, it used to stress me out because it, it's such a difficult car to drive. It feels like it's gonna stall every two seconds and the gears are weird and it's one of the most difficult cars you can drive period mazda speed as well no mazda speed is easy compared to this like this is difficult but i mean no not this sorry the sdi is difficult this is easy this is like cake so there's something weird with the um the turn signal you know how normally when you use your turn signal, you lock it, you hit it, and then it, it stays? Yeah. This one doesn't. It just, it's like, it touch, and then... Well, that's how I like it, actually. I like I like the touch. It gives you, like, a little five-second indicate, and then, yeah. it, then it resets. Cause See, because that's all I need. fancy. You like all that fancy stuff. Also so. because I don't indicate it long enough to... I indicate and then turn and go. Huh. All right. Let me see now. Where are all the sports... Mm. I'm guessing it's probably all in the menu. I don't want to mess with all the menu because in the SDI it was all like here. So yeah, I'm not even gonna bother. How do you? Where would that be? Ah, oh, what the heck? Let's just let's just floor it and have some fun. All right. Yeah. All right. Sounds like so. it. All right. And <laughs> How did that feel to you? <laughs> uh, I mean, it's not it's not ag aggressive to be honest with you. Yeah, no, it's not. It's not. It doesn't pull, and you're like, no, it's not. But but it's it's fun enough, you know. Yeah, it is. Yeah. I, I mean, for all wheel drive, you'd expect a little more torqueiness, but yes, 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 it's missing a little bit of the torque. Yeah. But it is smooth. It handles nice. I'm just I'm amazed at how smooth it is after coming out the SDI. It's quick. I mean, it's proper quick. Like, it's not slow, you know? It's not slow, but, but you know, it's comparative to you because you're in a Ford F-150 Raptor, so. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But, you know, we gotta, we gotta go race my truck versus your truck and see how that, how that plays out. Yeah, yeah. whenever you're ready to go to Mexico, we will. <laughs> yes, yes, we, we will race. We will take a trip out to Mexico and see. Yeah? So okay. you guys comment below. Who do you think is going to win in a, in a drag race? We got the driver mod Tacoma versus the my, my cousin and his Ford F-150 Raptor. Who are you guys rooting for? <laughs> and yours is a 22, right? Yeah. 
So yeah, so yours is the fast one. <laughs> yeah, it's ready, but it's not an R. It's not an R, but it's the fast uh, turbo six. Is it twin turbo or single turbo? Twin. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's proper quick. All right. Yeah, I remember like when I drove it, I was shocked at how it got up and left. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But I like this, man. I I think you know, cute or chaotic. If you're watching, I know you're gonna love this car, man. Like just driving it myself and having a little bit of fun in it. It's way more enjoyable to drive than my SDI. Like, way more enjoyable. Like, I could definitely see myself getting getting one of these. Now, would I trade in my Camaro for it? No. <laughs> you know? But, it is a heck of a car. It is a heck of a car. So, yeah. I mean, actually, you know what? If I really needed to, like... I would not get out of my truck for it. I prefer the truck, right? Because of all the, the stuff you can do with it. Oh, yeah, you're trying to... Yeah, you know. see, we can do something with the menu option, see? Yeah. Get so, let me see. What does this say over here? Okay, so that's, so that's all the AC controls and stuff right here. And maybe you do this. Oh, okay, yeah. Now you can do all that. So, you got your settings and all that. Map. I see. Oh wow, maps are already built in. So it's navigation by TomTom. Tom. So it's actually pretty cool. When was the last time you heard of TomTom? Tom? I don't know. It's I been, didn't even know they were still in business. <laughs> oh, but look at this though. Check it out. We got the sunroof. So yeah. See, you want to get close to heaven? There you go. Point that. Out. Let's show them that. Show up a forty roller. Canada is not going to have this soon. Look at that. Look how beautiful this is. We got that Florida sunshine. It's so bright, look, cousin got to wear sunglasses. <laughs> this is a fact. <laughs> yeah, you know? So, yeah, man, I don't know. I like this. I actually, okay, I, I like this better than the Golf R. So I drove the Golf R. That's a, that that's I'm tall. telling you, uh, I'm telling you. I don't know about that one. This is more enjoyable to drive than the Golf R. It just is. Wow. Yeah. Okay, that's saying a lot. Yeah, now I just need to figure out, though, Where's all the sports stuff? How do you put it into sports sharp and all that stuff? Like, that's something I'll have to figure out. I'm sure it's in a menu somewhere. I'm looking through the menu right now. It has oil temp, average speed, now miles an hour. Mm -hmm. It says you're in Miami, Fort Lauderdale. <laughs> but nothing really. Radio. Well, oh. go back to the. Oh, maybe it's in here. Driving vehicle control, other steering. Okay, so let's go first to this. Okay, no, that's. All right, let's see. Steering, driving assistance, uh, others. Okay. Huh. Yeah. My Subaru settings. Oh, yeah. No. So let's go back to the first. Okay, that's that. So settings, maybe? I just hit settings and it didn't have anything. Oh, okay, so you already tried that? Yes. Yeah, we did that. Android Auto, yeah. CarPlay. So let's try this and see. Okay, driving statistics. All right. Yeah, maintenance, engine oil, oil filter tires. Okay, so it has all that. I don't know if you guys know how to adjust the the sportiness of this of this car. If there's a way to do it, comment below and let us know. Is we're we're at a loss, and he's really smart. Like he he's a tech genius, and he doesn't know. I I'm a I'm a car guy, and I don't know. I haven't figured it out yet. <laughs> it's quite possible it doesn't have anything sporty. I mean that is possible, but I don't want to believe it. <laughs> it's... Yeah, let's go. Well, now that we got it idling, let's uh let's go take a look outside and check out underneath the hood and stuff. Check the hood. Turbo 
somewhere underneath there. It's there. <laughs> It's soft limited. I'm guessing it's. It's got a soft limiter. Is it soft limited? It no, sounds. It went all the way up to like eight grand. Oh really? Listen, man. All right. We both know this is not your cup of tea, but you gotta you gotta give this WRX its respect. All right. <laughs> Yeah, it's a it's a nice car to give your girlfriend or something. Oh. <laughs> all right, hey Q, don't don't listen to him. All right, <laughs> it's a good car. All right? <laughs> Come on, man, Q gonna want fights. We have to see in this video, yo. <laughs> he, he's gonna think about it and be like, yeah, he's right. Yeah. <laughs> well, he's fancy, like he. Ooh, hold up. I think that's my friend. With oh god, we got competition here now. <laughs> this is quicker? Like a second. Oh no. That's, that's not that's good. Tea. That is not good. So not even good for good enough for your wife. <laughs> your wife will well, beat you. <laughs> I love it. It, it drove uh, amazingly. It's fun. It's very well balanced. That's one of the main that's the reason why I think I said I like it better than the um than I like it better than the golf R. It's a little bit more well balanced. So if you guys are interested, forget all the hate, come get you a 22 WRX. Race car friends, out.